So Granderson, Cabrera, and Cespedes, the first three hitters Lucas Giolito will face. Well, there you see the double A numbers 14 starts, 5 and 3 records, 72 strikeouts in 71 innings. Currently rated by ESPN.com and MLB.com, the number one prospect in Major League Baseball. Last start was on June 22nd against Portland. Granderson, shorter lead, not running. Swing and a miss. Strikeout. Number one in the major leagues for Lucas Giolito. And they will authenticate the baseball. He authenticated the fastball, 96 miles an hour, said, here it is, hit it. Some good old-fashioned country hardball in the reach back. There's the arsenal for Ronaldo. Fastball averaging 96 miles an hour. Curveball changed to go with it. Swing and a miss on 98. Upstairs. Off speed. That's pitching right there. Showing them the 98. He's playing some good old country hardball here in Atlanta right now. Swing and a miss on 97 upstairs. Wow. 98 with command and location. That would be early. <laughs> wow. 81 straight down. Seven strikeouts. See ya. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Well. Some numbers going down right there. With the 29th selection of the 2016 MLB draft, the Washington Nationals select Dane Dunning, a right-handed pitcher from the University of Florida. The Chicago White Sox are going all in on their rebuild. Yeah, they're dumping um, Adam Eaton, right? Well, I don't know if dumping is the right word. Are you, Trading are you familiar with Adam Eaton? Yes. He's been in the league, in the majors for four seasons, four full seasons-ish, three and a half, really. He's 28 years old, hit 284 with 14 homers, 59 RBIs last year. Very fine. He's good. good players. It's okay. The Washington Nationals have just agreed to a trade for him. It's pending physicals and whatnot. They gave up the numbers one, three, and six prospects in their farm system, which includes Lucas Giolito, who's their star They gave up Lucas Giolito. Prospect. Wow. For He's Adam the Eaton? number three overall prospect in all of baseball. Wait, for Adam Eaton? Yeah. The White Sox, between this trade, the Adam Eaton trade, and the Chris Sale trade, have Kenny Williams started. Kenny this. Williams doing some things. You have to get like, oh, he got a great contract here. He got a good player. Is he spectacularly good? No, but he's a really good player. All right, here's my take. Here's my uh, my honest take on this. Adam Eaton's a darn good player. Scrappy. It, everything that Mike Rizzo just described him as as he is. I don't know if Adam Eaton, to give up the monster package that they gave up, I, I don't think it addresses their flaw. I flaw or want, not? Hold up. Flaw or not? You talking about prospects, though. So prospects for me. I was a prospect. You were a prospect. I was a suspect. Well, what, whatever you were. <laughs> for me, you talking about, they, talk, they said Willie McCovey. I didn't talk to be Willie McCovey. Yes. I, I, for me, <laughs> I, I was nowhere near Willie McCovey. So when we talk about all these prospects that they gave up, let's get off the I prospect thing. No, don't get off the prospect you, thing. You, get, you can't get off the prospect Why can't you get off thing? of it? Because it panned out for the Cubs. Every it, single it, guy it they drafted. It don't always pan out, though, That's what I'm them. talking about. And they all want, you they got a major league ready ball player. He's there. Adam Eaton has shown he can play at the big league level. The other three, they ain't showing us nothing, but they're good at the minor league. Oh, I agree with so you know what? A lot of stuff to get off my chest, and we've been all over the winter meetings this week. I got to tell you, I officially have no idea what on earth the Washington Nationals are doing. First, they don't resign Mark Melanson, who was ideal as their closer. Then they lose out to the Boston Red Sox on Chris Sale, who would have been perfect as an ace. And then today, you can't make this up. The Nets just sent late this afternoon three of their top six prospects to the White Sox in exchange for Adam Eaton. Adam Eaton. Adam Eaton. Are you kidding me? Oh, guess who else is surprised? This guy. Bryce Harper, wow. I mean, think about, Giolito was untouchable. 
They wouldn't trade Giolito last year to the Yankees for Andrew Miller. They wouldn't package Giolito in a deal for Chapman. Adam Eaton? Wow is right, Bryce Harper. I mean, I get it. You're embarrassed. The winter meetings are in D.C. You thought you were getting sale. You wanted to re-sign Melanson. But this? Adam Eaton, nice player. He's not special. Our seven all-star, are you kidding me? That's one of the worst deals I've ever seen. White Sox, by the way, with a tremendous 24 hours, said they needed to restock the farm system. But Washington! That's called strike three. Uh, he struck him out. Two and two. Uh, he struck him out. Uh, Jack Swing, he went around. I mean, it's just a rewrite history. Because I'm in the mood to label us the leaders of the leaders of the new school. This ain't for the radio. Can't find this on YouTube. It's the type of killing that these critics say is to. Strike three. Two and two. Victorious. Struck him out. Nine strikeouts for Lopez. Seven innings, 86 pitches. No, he's kept it to a minimum and just dominated a pretty decent lineup. Oz waits in the one two. Struck him out swinging. Lopez has 10 strikeouts. Mastery today for Ronaldo Lopez. Two and two for Reyes. He 
struck him out. Another slider. Sorcery today from Lopez for his first career complete game. What a job. A one hitter was as close to perfection as you're going to find. A couple of early walks and then complete dominance all the way. A huge smile. And two and two on the leadoff man for Myrtle Beach. Pitch from Dunning. Fastball at the knees in the outer half called strike three. So Dunning has the strikeout. Here's the set and the 3 2. Myers swings and misses and strikes out. Good changeup off the outside.